Welcome back to the Viewbox and Series. Today I'll be reading the two minute story. Let's get to it. And that is it for the two minute story. It's actually a very short and small book. Uh, I've read it in 51 minutes and it is 95 pages long. So that puts it at 111 pages per hour. This is not the kind of book I expected. This is actually a book to build your pyramid scheme. A pyramid scheme is a kind of business that is illegal in some countries. The principle is you have one person that motivates several people under him to sell the products he offers. Those people only get paid if they provide a sale. The best way they can do to provide a sale is to actually get other people under them to sell that product for themselves. As you go down the layers, you build a pyramid with all the people at the bottom that will sell everything and everyone on top that will not do anything. Why is a pyramid scheme dangerous? Let's suppose to make a living you need to have 10 people under you making their sales. So with the first person you get 10 people under. If those 10 people get 10 people under them, we arrive at 100 people. If those 100 people get 10 people under them, we arrive at 1000 people. So with only 3 steps, we arrive at 1000. Add another three steps and you arrive at a million people. You want to add three more steps, you arrive at a billion people involved in this game. What happens with this format is that it becomes quickly very dangerous as you will not be able to find enough people to do the sales for you if you are a few levels down. If you are at the top, if you're the founder, it's going to be very comfortable for you. But for everyone else below, it's going to become more and more difficult. Those kind of organizations are usually not sustainable and this is why it is illegal in many places and many people have suffered from it as a result. Now that we have that out of the way, let's get back to the book. What the book teaches is a one-page sales pitch. You can have an example here, I don't know if you're going to be able to see, but it's less than one page long. The book goes out in detail into sentence by sentence and word per word why they use this and how you can apply them to your own pyramid scheme. They don't say pyramid scheme in the book, but it is clearly a pyramid scheme. They actually go through all the typical scam sentences, such as, so how much money will it take you so that you never have to shop to work again? The way they build their pitch is actually interesting, where they start interesting slowly the listener, they increase the interest and the curiosity, and of course ends up with trying to conclude an agreement with the listener. I would not recommend using the techniques are in this book. However, it can be interesting reading it to know how to recognize a current scheme and avoid getting caught into one. That is it for today. I think it's going to be a shorter video because it's a shorter book. I will see you soon with a new book. I hope you enjoyed this one. Let me know in the comments what you think. And if you enjoyed, let me know by giving a thumbs up.